Hello. Welcome back to my channel. My name is not Mario, but Romantic Mario. And this is Romantic Dress Relief. If you couldn't tell, today I'm going to be doing romantic academia inspired outfits that are suitable for summer and I really like these outfits that I came up with and I'm definitely going to be wearing these during the summer so I hope you enjoy this and I hope it gives you some outfit inspiration. I know it is hotter and more humid in other places so I hope this at least gives you some ideas for your own outfits and if it does, don't forget to give a like and comment down below what else you want to see in the future. And also follow me on Instagram at The Dress Relief if you want some more fashion content from me. Or if you just want some general updates on my channel, I usually post those on my story there. And yeah, let's get started. So first off, when I think of romantic academia, puff sleeves is kind of the first thing that comes to mind as well as some certain types of fabrics like lace, silk, you know, things that are more feminine and flowy. So first off, I have this puff sleeve blouse, which is actually a dress that I tucked into these trousers. And it has a really nice kind of rotary-like detailing in the fabric. And I love the amount of puff the sleeve has and the square neckline. Um, I think it's just really flattering. So I think this top gives off more of the romantic vibe of this outfit. Meanwhile, the pleated trousers gives off more of the academia vibe. And they are in a very thin fabric, so it's definitely breathable for the summer. This probably won't work if you're wearing like wool trousers for the summer. That is going to be very hot and I definitely do not recommend. Fabric types is super important for keeping cold during the summer. I recommend something like linen or cotton because, you know, this aesthetic is not worth getting heat stroke for, guys. Please keep cool. And then for shoes, I have on these nude colored block heels and for a purse, I have this brown baguette purse but I'm kind of looking for a more academia style brown purse so something like an envelope purse or like a satchel style purse so if you have any suggestions, let me know in the comments. Okay, so very similar outfit here. I'm again wearing this white puff sleeve blouse slash dress and instead of tucking into trousers, I tucked it into these khaki shorts and I think this is a super cute outfit and I'm definitely going to be wearing these khaki shorts more throughout this video, so stay tuned. And for shoes, again, I wear my little nude heels and this brown baguette purse. Again, if you have suggestions for a more academia style purse, let me know in the comments. And yeah, this is pretty much it and definitely one of my favorite outfits. Okay, for this outfit, I was going for kind of like a safari, jungle, expedition kind of look. Like, you know, looking like I'm about to go train some dinosaurs at Jurassic Park, but I'm gonna look hella cute while doing it. So I have this button-down shirt, and I went for a long sleeve one, but you can also opt for a short sleeve button-down shirt if it's hotter where you live. And I tucked that into my khaki shorts, and then I accessorized with a cute little scarf tied around my neck, and I think it would also look cute if you tie it around your head and wear some like vintage sunglasses or something. And instead of heels, this time I opted for some more comfy beige sneakers. Okay, now this outfit feels like something you'd wear to a country club, but then again, I've never been to a country club, so I'm not quite sure about that. But I feel like if I were ever to go golfing, I would wear something along these lines. So I have on this polo shirt, which is actually a polo dress, and I just tucked it into some khaki shorts. And if you couldn't tell already, I always love tucking in dresses and wearing them as tops. And then for shoes, I have on these comfy sneakers. And yeah, I feel like the collar and the cuff stripe detailing kind of gives off that academia vibe, though it is more on the preppy side with the light blue color scheme. And it's not quite as romantic academia as the other outfits, but I just like it and I think it's cute. So yeah, country club vibes. Okay, next, if you follow me on Instagram, 
the dress relief. Then you probably already saw me wear this outfit. So I have on this beige and white lace bustier, which is inspired by the For Love and Lemons dolly bustier, but that one was too expensive for me and actually sold out by the time I found it. So my mom came in clutch and actually made this for me and she did an amazing job, of course, because she's my mom. But I think it really just fits the romantic aspect because of the pretty lace detailing and these beautiful long ribbons for the straps. And then of course I tucked it into some pleated trousers, this time in a more chocolate brown color than the dark khaki color we saw earlier. And again I wore it with my nude block heels because they just go with everything. For this next outfit, I wore this brown maxi dress and layered this cardigan over it and I kind of tied the cardigan in the back and tucked it in to make it look like it's tucked into a skirt just because I kind of like that look and again I wore my nude block heels and I feel like the cardigan gives off more of the academia vibe and just the general color scheme of it it is definitely more on the casual side but also I feel like this dress makes me look so tall, it makes my legs look so long like. Look at this, legs for days. But yeah, I see myself wearing this to go to like a museum or art gallery during the summer. Okay, so for this outfit, I have on my plaid mini skirt and my chunky loafers. And then I tucked in this lace turtleneck, and I know a turtleneck sounds really uncomfortable for the summer, but since it's lace, I find it to be very breathable and not too bad for warmer weather. And again, I feel like certain fabrics like lace, silk, velvet, you know, luxurious fabrics kind of give off that romantic aesthetic. So I feel like this lace turtleneck gives off kind of that romantic vibe and also kind of reminds me of vintage weddings. So I definitely use it for subconsciously hinting to my boyfriend that I want to marry him with the repetition of seeing lace subconsciously planting into his mind the idea of a wedding. Okay, no, I'm just kidding about that part. Unless. But yeah, I think it's a cute feminine academia look. Okay, for this next outfit, I wore this black lingerie dress tucked into my trousers, so worn as a top again. And I feel like lingerie is super romantic and feminine, especially if it has lace detailing. I think it definitely fits the romantic part of romantic academia. And again, the pleated trousers are more on the academia side, as well as these pointed toe heels. And of course, any black purse would work for this outfit. This outfit is great for those of you who live in a very hot and maybe humid area because um, it's obviously a little less covered. I have on the black dress again and tucked it into a plaid mini skirt this time. And then I swapped out the pointed toe heels for these chunky loafers. So yeah, if you really can't bear to be so covered, I think this outfit kind of works. Again, the lace is a little romantic, but the plaid skirt is kind of more on the academia side. Okay, so another outfit idea I have but I can't show you because I just ordered this dress and it has not arrived yet unfortunately is like a white puff sleeve midi dress. I think it's super flowy and modest and it looks really great for summer and kind of fits the academia vibe as well. And the flowiness of a midi skirt just really screams like romantic academia to me. So that's another outfit I'm planning on wearing and I'm hoping to pair it with maybe again my nude block heels or some espadrilles sandals. So yeah, I just wanted to throw that in there because in my head I think it's going to be a really cute outfit and I think it does fit this aesthetic as well. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this and again if you did leave a like and a comment down below let me know which outfits you liked or if you have your own outfit ideas or if you have some video suggestions for me and follow me on instagram at the dress relief and on tiktok at dress relief for some more fashion content updates on my channel and things like that and i will see you guys next time